Welcome to today's video guys, it's great to see you back and if you're new here, my name is Jay Yudlowski and on this channel we talk about DaVinci Resolve, Photography, Photoshop, Lightroom and even a little bit of video and video editing. And in today's video, we're going to be in DaVinci Resolve and talking about how to create a voiceover track. So let's jump into the video. Alright guys, we're in a little studio here. I thought this would be a great place to make this video talking about voiceovers and adding audio into one of your videos here in DaVinci Resolve. So you don't need an extra program or a different program to record your audio. You can do it right in DaVinci Resolve. It's pretty easy, it's not too hard, and I'm going to show you how to do it. So let's jump into DaVinci Resolve and check it out. Here we are in DaVinci Resolve and I'm in the edit tab and I've already gone ahead and added in some clips to my timeline here that I can use for my voiceover. So now that I got my clips there, I want to come down to my audio track. I'm going to right click and I want my audio track type to be a mono audio track. The next thing I'm going to do is just rename the track here so it's easy to find. I call it voiceover. Get rid of that space there. Next, once we have our track named, we're going to come over into the Fairlight tab. So we've got our track selected here. We've got nothing on it right now. All we have is the video in our viewer up here. So the first thing that we need to do here is to tell DaVinci Resolve to record from my microphone onto this audio track. So in order to do that, we come up to the Fairlight menu at the top, come down to Patch Input Output. And now on this side, on the left, we see we have our Yeti left and right. So I'm just going to select one of those since we want a mono input. And then on the destination side, I'm going to click on the drop down menu and come to track input. So I only have one track now, so I'm going to select that track. If you had multiple audio tracks, you would see them all appear here. So we just have one. I'm going to select the voiceover track and click patch. So then we're all set. DaVinci Resolve knows to record anything that comes from my Blue Yeti microphone onto the voiceover track. So you can go ahead and close that window. Now down in the track here, we want to arm our track to record. In order to arm the track for recording, there's a little R here and you want to click that. Now that's going to say, okay, we want to record on that track. And you can see the meters moving here because DaVinci Resolve is receiving the audio from my microphone and applying it to the track. So now all we have to do is come up here, press record, watch our video and say whatever it is you want to say for your voiceover. So let's go ahead. The Behringer X32 is a wonderful soundboard. It's got 32 channels of input and can meet all of your audio needs. And then you just click stop when you're done. So let's uh, zoom in here a little bit. You can see our waveform. So let's play this back and see how it sounds. And actually, first, I'm going to turn off the recording. And I'm going to turn up my speakers a little bit. And let's see how it sounds. The Behringer X32 is a wonderful soundboard. It's got 32 channels of input and can meet all of your audio needs. So there you go. Now you've got your audio directly into DaVinci Resolve. You can go through and make any adjustments or changes that you'd want to right here in the audio panel. And if we jump back into the edit tab, you see we've got our audio right on our voiceover track. Works out great. It's super easy. You don't need any extra programs or anything. You can record your audio right here in DaVinci Resolve. All right, so thank you guys for checking out this video. If you're into DaVinci Resolve, photography, Photoshop, Lightroom, and even a little bit of video and video editing, consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Maybe you want to pick one of these videos up here, check out some more DaVinci Resolve, or maybe you want to check out something else. So subscribe to my channel and go check that out.